Hey YouTube, Adam the Piper here. Uh, hope everybody's had a good week. I'm very happy that it's Friday. We got our cold snow. We were 40s, high 40s, low 30s, and then Wednesday. Is it Wednesday? Thursday. Wednesday. Uh, we went from 31 degrees to right around negative 12 air um wind chill in about an hour or so a little housekeeping i'm smoking my roma 673 savinelli and in it some prince albert uh this tin's about a year old i've got way too many containers open um Truth be told, I'm trying to remember the last time I actually completely finished a tobacco. I think it's been quite a while. Uh, got, I don't know how many different things open. Had the day off yesterday, was gonna try to do a video. And I was at the eye doctor, doctor's appointment in the morning and then an eye doctor at right after that and had my eyes dilated so I had a uh, flying saucers for eyes trying to find everything and decided that probably wouldn't be the best so I had a box opening I tried doing this video earlier and then got a little bit sidetracked and lost my train of thought but um, I ordered from and this is gonna be a whole nother story here in a minute but ordered some mixture 79 Um, few people have been talking about it either they really don't like it or they think it's pretty good um, some more plum pudding and I've never had this one but it sounded pretty good uh, Deceptions Passed by Seattle Pipe Club and a few different aromatics um, I'm not going to go through all of them but We'll, I'll do some reviews on them here as they start coming up. Uh, butterscotch flavored ones and some maple ones. So, um, as most of you guys know, uh, I'm a cigarette smoker too. And recently, <coughs> well, like last Friday recently, I ended up in the hospital uh, with chest pains. I back up to four packs a day. So I gotta quit smoking cigarettes, but the doctor told me I can keep smoking a pipe, beans I'm not inhaling it. So I'm gonna start t trying to find another blend that's gonna be more of a go-to blend that I can smoke all day long. And then I ordered some, uh, oh, <laughs> sorry guys, um, some uh, vanilla cigars, just to try to see if that helps out at all. This is Bella. I think she's filled neglected. I haven't really visited with or pet any of them since I've been home. Go down, I'll pet you later. So yeah, that's what's been going on in my life here lately. I um, think that's a lot to do with uh, some of the reason why I've been getting on doing videos as much. I just haven't been filling myself. So yeah, a uh, little outlook for the weekend. Ray and I are going to go ice fishing on Sunday. So tomorrow I'm going to dig everything out and try to get everything set up. And then i got to go over and lay some linoleum over at my mom's house. I'll take you guys with when we go ice fishing. Kind of show you what I use for ice fishing and how simple I keep it. Because I hear guys spending thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars. Now they're catching a lot more fish and they're going out ice fishing a lot more than I am. Because truth be told, when it comes to ice fishing, I'm a bit of a pansy. I don't like thin ice and I don't know what the ice thickness is at right now. I think I've heard anywhere is between 8 and 16 inches so that should be good enough for me. So yeah, I uh, just wanted to pop on, say hi to everybody. Um, been catching up on a lot of videos. Um, do a couple shout outs Sunday. I got some names to write down. Um, they're fairly they're fairly new presenters. They're not 
super new. Um, a lot of the channels are really great channels. These guys are working just as hard on as they can be and pumping out a lot of really good things. So, a um, little quick, I don't, I'm not trying to bash any company, but um, I won't even say their name. I'm finding that with this one particular tobacco comp tobacconist online, uh, it used to be if I paid for extra shipping and handling, whatever, to have it delivered a little sooner, I'd get it a day or so sooner, which still took about four days, but um, the last two times I've ordered from them, I've noticed that even though I spend the extra, like this last order I just got, took me a week and a half to get. I just got it today. Uh, I paid for the two to, I think it was two to four, or two to six day shipping. It was quite six, two to four, some, somewhere in there. Um, don't pay for extra shipping unless you know it's going to come sooner. Uh, I got confirmation emails from this company saying that they were ready to ship out right away. And so my word of advice, everybody don't pay for the extra shipping. Just let it come on its own when it'll be there. there it's not going to save you no more time. So, but with that being said, I know it's kind of a blank ramble. Um, I think I'm going to let you guys go. Uh, look for you guys Sunday. With that being said, have a good weekend, everybody, and happy smoking. Thanks for watching.